design your spaces, think about the movement of the kiddos. They love to play, they love to move. I know that the space is working when they're they're engaged, they're having fun or they're they're getting their materials out and doing their work. You can kind of look around and see that they get it. They know what they're supposed to be doing. What did we get before? 42. When we designed the classroom, I thought about what they needed, what stations they needed. I sat down, I was like, what do we need? And I mapped it out. I mapped it all out and just started drawing what would work well next to each other. Like I went from there and then just played with my room to see if it would flow better in the room. If something was blocking something, I didn't like that. I wanted it to feel more open and so that the kids didn't feel like it was too much in the room. When we're having fun that way, it moves better. So please bunny hop to your next station. Adapting to it, it's, it's hard, it takes time. It's not going to happen overnight. It's a lot of practice. When they come in, we are constantly going over the routine of, of moving through this, the classroom, um, practicing, practicing, practicing. That's huge for them. I think that's where the frustration comes is because you think, oh my God, this is not gonna work. And then it does. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of you. We're a ways into the school year and it is so great just to be able to see that independence in them and the growth in them. Changing the way we structure things, I was really nervous and this was a huge change for us. But you talk about having conversations with kiddos, this was huge with that. Like just being able to sit down and talk to them at a station. It's all about that customer service really in the classroom and ha building those relationships with kiddos. And I feel like moving to this this year and moving to what the kiddos needed, it just makes me feel comfortable about me as a teacher and what I'm doing. Creating that loving, engaging area, it helps make your day so much better. Like if you feel comfortable in your room, if you feel like your kids are moving great, doing great, you're gonna feel happy to move out and get engaged and have fun with them. Cause that's what I feel is important in the classroom. And then they have fun with you and your day is just so much nicer.